I was observing in the motion of a boat which was rapidly drawn along a narrow channel by a pair of horses, when the boat suddenly stopped. Not so the mass of water in the channel which it had put in motion. It accumulated around the prow of the vessel in a state of violent agitation, and then suddenly, leaving it behind, rolled forward with great velocity, assuming the form of a large, solitary elevation, a rounded, smooth, and well-defined heap of water, which continued its course along the channel, apparently without change of form or diminution of speed. I followed it on horseback, and overtook it, still rolling on at a rate of some eight or nine miles an hour, preserving its original feature, some thirty feet long and a foot to a foot and a half in height. Its height gradually diminished, and after a chase of one or two miles I lost it in the windings of the channel. Such in this month of August 1834 was my first chance interview with that singular and beautiful phenomenon.